WhatsApp is the biggest messaging app in the world, but did you know you can make it even better using extensions and third-party apps? Whether you want to set up an autoresponder to certain people or set up a Wikibot that sends you Wikipedia entries right in WhatsApp, there's a lot you can do with WhatsApp that you didn't know about. Hi, this is Phil from Make Tech Easier, and this is five apps for WhatsApp you have to try. WhatsApp is a free social messaging app owned by Facebook that lets you send text messages, images, maps, documents, voice and video calls and recorded voice messages. Over 1 billion people worldwide use it every day to stay in touch because it's completely free and unlimited to use and very effective too. Among its long list of capabilities include group text messaging, push notifications, end-to-end -end encryption with supported versions and its compatibility with most smartphones. As good as it sounds, it can still do better, which is why there are apps and extensions you can add to your WhatsApp app and do a lot more than just send your messages. Here are five of the best apps or extensions you can use with WhatsApp for a richer experience. Autoresponder for WhatsApp. Autoresponder is another good app you can use to create a better experience for your contacts. You can automatically respond to custom received messages on WhatsApp or WA Business using the chatbot and customise each auto-reply to your liking. The app is free to download and features many automation tools that let you react to messages when busy, send replies to specific messages, create a welcome message for new chats and a lot more. If you want to schedule replies, you can use the automatic scheduler and even add delays based on when you'd like the message to be sent. It not only works with your contacts, but also with groups and unknown numbers, and you can ignore and specify contacts and groups. If you're using WA Business for your small business, this chatbot can act as a personal agent. The downside is that you can't send pictures, stickers, videos or other media files. It also doesn't work with WhatsApp web and tablet apps. However, the app is still in beta with promises of new features coming soon like font formatting styles, driving mode and a widget. Note, if it doesn't work for you, update WhatsApp Messenger to the very latest version. Transcriber for WhatsApp Transcriber for WhatsApp is a free, handy app that converts WhatsApp voice notes to text. If you keep receiving voice messages and can't open them because the situation at the time doesn't allow, the app will convert the voice to text messages so you can read them later. To use it, just install the app and then select the voice message, tap on the share icon in WhatsApp and choose Transcriber. It'll display the transcription in the same WhatsApp screen. The app will transcribe only the portions with voice in them and within seconds you have your message ready to read. For people with hearing problems, this app is really useful. However, the quality of the transcription depends on the person and the time of day, as not all words get picked up, even when they're spoken using good English. You can also change the language from the app settings if you don't want it in English only, but currently it only supports English and Italian. WA Toolkit this Chrome extension is a must-have if you use WhatsApp Web on your desktop Chrome browser. It's free to use and allows you to expand the width of the chat bubbles to full width so you can optimise and utilise the extent of your monitor. In your Chrome toolbar, you'll find the WA Toolkit icon that adds message badges that separate read from unread messages. Simply hover over it and read all your incoming messages without opening the web client. This saves time and you can read messages without the recipient getting the scene blue ticks. It also offers connectivity notifications that turn the icon orange in case your phone has connection issues, which is common with the web version. Plus, desktop support is available thanks to the always-on desktop notifications that still show even after you close Chrome. Wikibot Wikibot is another extension you can use for WhatsApp that offers quick explanations and meanings to queries directly from Wikipedia. It's like your own little dictionary within the app and you don't have to install or download anything to use it. It's also easy to set up by adding Wikibot's phone number to your contact list, save as Wikibot, and then typing in a command and sending it to the contact. It'll respond with a confirmation prompt that acknowledges you've activated the service, plus how to unsubscribe and alert you that you're ready to enjoy the service. To get started, you can send any word or phrase and the tool will reply with the definition. This way, you don't have to leave WhatsApp to look up a person or meaning on Google. Sticker Maker This is a really cool app that you can use to create unique stickers on WhatsApp, 
instead of using the default emojis and emoticons or other downloaded images and stickers. With Sticker Maker you can import photos or memes from your own gallery and create up to 30 stickers per pack for WhatsApp with as many packs as you want. To get started, download the app and then create your stickers. Name the pack and add stickers to it. Next, publish the sticker pack to WhatsApp and start enjoying your stickers. While WhatsApp is useful, it does not contain all the features you need. With the above extensions and many more out there, you can install and make use of the features you need to add to your productivity. Okay, as always, thanks for watching. That's all for now. See you next time.